Good morning, my garden friends. It's Monday morning, and Monday for us is cutting the grass day and doing some yard work. But I wanted to say this, that for me, every day is work in the garden day. Even if it's just not really work, it's go through and pick some things up, you know, like leaves that maybe are... Uh, have fallen and that look like they might have some fungus on the end of them on the back side and so it's just kind of going and assessing what needs to be done and I think a lot of the times people get so overwhelmed by what needs to be done that they stay in the house and they don't do anything and well that is not a good idea is it and uh, and then you're frustrated because you um, you feel bad. You think that you know, oh, bad Peggy. You know, I didn't get anything done. And really, you just need to go through and pick up as you're going along. And it gives you a moment to say, well, is that a a friend or a foe? Is that a weed? Or is that a flower? And it looks silly for me to be doing this and showing it to you this way. But I really think that if you look and assess everything that maybe needs to be done or can go off another day or two and get put on tomorrow's list, and by the time you finish, you've kind of gone through, you've looked at everything, and now, whenever Rick brings the lawnmower through here, he isn't going to mow up leaves that maybe have a fungus in them. And, and then I use it in my, uh, as my mulch, and now I've added it back to the system. Well, I don't want that. So uh, I like to take care of things before, uh, before they get to be a problem. So anyway, that was it. I just wanted to, to take a few minutes and just show you what I do. Um, the compost pile, by the way, is looking really quite nice. I keep coming over here and uh, making sure that it's okay. and There's no fungusy leaves in it. And about every other day I've been flipping it over and I think you can see it's really uh, really incorporating it well and uh, I think that's probably about all that's new and exciting going on I know tomorrow I wanted to do a end of the month tour of the yard and show you but this morning was just kind of a little uh, jab in your in your butt if that's what it takes for you to go out and look at your yard front and back sides um, depending on what size yard you have maybe you just go out in your balcony and assess things and say gee this needs to be cleaned off or if you have a huge property I, I used to have 14 and a half acres and I used to go out there and look at everything and go oh, I'll never get it done and it was so it was always uphill um, until I learned to just take a little piece of it and try to tame that spot and then uh, add on to it and take another little piece and and tame that and so you know garden what you've got make it make it your personal situation and uh, I hope you'll subscribe and enjoy and ring the bell and I hope to see you soon take care bye bye